Well, I was able to take a walk outside today uh, with my dog without the umbrella, so that was a good thing. And I saw a lot of people, believe it or not, in shorts today. Meteorologist Kristen Emery will take us into 2022 as we look ahead weather-wise. Cold air, colder air and somewhat cold air is on the way to start the new year. So you may as well take advantage of wearing the shorts today, tomorrow, Friday. Uh, definitely temperatures above normal into the 50s. But we have to dodge a couple of more raindrops before we get to the colder air. 49 right now, and we're dry. Mostly cloudy skies in Pittsburgh. We've been dry most of the day, and we're looking at calm air right now. The winds remain very, very mild as we head through the evening. Temperatures ranging from 39 up in Franklin, 41 in Clarion, down to the mid 40s in Butler, Catanning, Newcastle. We're in the upper 40s in Beaver Falls, Pittsburgh, Greensburg. And then we had some 50s just the last hour or so. Wheeling, Washington dropped from 50. Morgantown still hanging on to 51, but you can see that temperature range. The warmer air still sort of bottled up down to the south, but it's going to stay in place as we head through the next uh, two days. Current temperature is 49. The high did make it up to 50. If you're wondering, the record high for today is 67. Nowhere near there, but December has been a very warm month. Overall, the average temperature, and we're factoring in the highs and the lows all month, starting this morning, this was as of this morning, was 40.3 degrees. That's 6.2 degrees above average. Now, the warmest December on record was way back in 1889 when we averaged 46.1 degrees. But the second warmest December ever, or on record rather, you might remember this back in 2015, 44.5 degrees. So as we have mid to upper 50s on the way, uh, as we head toward uh, the last day of the year and more 50s tomorrow, we'll likely inch up there. Right now we're about eighth on the list. Current conditions, there you see that 51 in Morgantown, 48 in Greensburg. Everyone reporting mostly cloudy skies. Now, we even had a couple of observations. Indiana Butler, for a minute, they had clear skies and a glimpse of sunshine. But look at the disparity in temperatures. We're in the 50s, really pretty much south of the Mason-Dixon line. And then look at this. They're freezing up in Lansing, Toledo, South Bend in the 30s. That colder air will stay in place to the northwest. We get the warmer air Moving in here tomorrow, again, temperatures up in the lower 50s. Stationary front, low pressure draped to the south of us, and that's going to usher in showers late tonight through tomorrow morning. Not a lot of rain, just hit or miss showers. Earlier model runs tried to bring that nose of moisture to the south in here by midnight. Still looking at maybe a shower for those of you south of I-70 by midnight, but most of us, it'll be tomorrow morning till we get a couple of showers and then just hit or miss showers really tomorrow and Thursday and uh, Friday. And then Saturday is going to be the soaker of a day. It looks like we'll wake up to steady rain and it'll linger all the way through lunchtime. Could get up to an inch of rain, but it looks like it'll hold off until after midnight. For New Year's Eve, look at the sharply colder temperatures on Monday. Could see a few snow showers Sunday night.